these three stretches will help give your body a little bit of a boost, a little bit of the energy you need, and feel relaxed, de-stressed, and ready to take on the rest of your obligations. So first we have the seated neck stretch. We're gonna interlace our fingers and clasp the back of our neck. So you're gonna be want you really want to sit really tall, you know, have a really nice line of energy flowing down your spine. So we have our interlaced fingers here, and you're gonna drop your chin towards your chest on your exhale and breathe really deep here. If you pull up on the back of your neck a little bit, it's really gonna intensify the stretch, make a lot of room in the back of your shoulders give a lot of love to you know your whole spine. It's just a great thing to do any time of the day. So hold that for about 30 seconds and you'll be ready to go. So next we have the wrist stretch, which is really great for someone who's typing all day long um, or is dealing with early symptoms of carpal tunnel. So you don't wanna have to deal with that later on. So it's really easy wrist stretch. We put our palm out in front of us with fingers facing up towards the ceiling. With the opposite hand, we reach around, grab, and pull back on that wrist. So you're gonna wanna hold this for about five seconds and you wanna feel the stretch in your wrist, but nothing too intense that it hurts. You just want it to feel good and really give a nice little release there. So we're gonna let this go, roll out your wrist a little bit, shake it out, go on the other side, same thing. And you're gonna feel just a really nice openness in your wrist, ready to take on everything else you have to do. And finally, last but not least, we have a seated mountain pose. So if you take a lot of yoga, you've heard about mountain pose a lot. It's kind of the neutral place that you go to reconnect, breathe deep, and bring a really nice line of energy to the back of your body and, you know, really a great stress reliever. So you can do that while you're sitting too. It's kind of, you know, half of one with your upper body, but great nonetheless. So we interlace our fingers again like we did before and then press our palms up towards the ceiling, dropping our shoulders back, making sure that you know our ears aren't too close to our um, elbows, pulling back. And if you want to intensify this one and get a really nice side stretch, you can reach to the right. Oh, that feels so good. Center, and on your exhale to the left. Center, okay. So easy, you're gonna feel so much energy, really comfortable in your body, and be able to take on the rest of your day.